Good morning. Good morning. So normally I do my videos on my iPad, but I can't take my iPad with me everywhere. And uh, we spend a good two or three hours outside every day. So um, I'm going to be doing the vlog on my phone. And hopefully the quality is not shit. So. <laughs> good morning. You are so happy in the mornings. Yes, I was so happy in the morning. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So while she's still in a good mood, we'll try to do some tummy time. I normally like to get her in the mood by putting her on her back and playing with this rattle. It is her favorite. She engages with it really well. Yes, I love it. So, let's flip it over. This really will probably only last a couple of minutes. Oh, there we go. Oh, get there. Okay. Hello. The animals are ready for a ride. Spin the Ferris wheel. <laughs> Brown bear. Okay, you can do it. You can do it. You're doing great. So today it only lasted about two minutes. <laughs> She's smiling again. It only lasted about two minutes before she got frustrated and I had to flip her back over. So normally we do two or three times a day. Uh, we try to go for five minutes, but she's not having it this morning. So just small sessions and um, it'll get the job done. That's my favorite color. <laughs> so while she's engaged on the play mat, I'm going to try and tackle some of her laundry, which pretty much just takes over my entire life. It is now 9.20 and I am having my drink that I drink every morning and it is this. Upspring Milk Flow. I'm drinking the chocolate one today. I also have the berry one. I haven't tried it yet, but I am not gonna lie, a little nervous to try it. Sometimes things like this are disgusting. But the chocolate one is really good. Sometimes if I don't have time, I'll mix it with uh, one of these. Um, if I don't have time to eat breakfast, I'll mix it with one of these. And, um, That'll keep me full for a couple of hours. But today I'm actually going to make breakfast. So I'm just going to drink this. Um, my supply went down a lot while I was in the hospital a couple weeks ago. I had like a really random surgery and was unable to breastfeed. So I started drinking this every day. And my supply is so back to normal that this morning I woke up and there was a big giant wet spot on the bed from where I was leaking. So this is awesome. And I mix it with almond milk, and it is pretty tasty. Scared in the ice. The farmer wrapped him in his coat and carried him back to the nice warm barn. The duckling stayed in the barn, and the farmer took... 
It's 9.45 and dad got her down for her first little nap of the day. She takes like four or five tiny 20 to 30 minute naps a day. So today's breakfast is two eggs and I'm probably gonna have an orange. Normally I try to eat either eggs or oatmeal because both foods are very good for your supply, I've heard. And it seems to be working. So now it is 10.30 and Mason woke up from her nap and wanted to eat a little. So now we're just hanging out. Um, she's just staring at me, fighting her sleep. I knew she was tired. Um, she still is tired. <laughs> but you're laughing at me now. Okay. So it's now 11.20 and Mason is asleep with her dad so I'm going to get dressed and brush my teeth and get ready for my day after Keith leaves for work and I always say that whatever I don't get done before Keith leaves it's not getting done so have to make sure that I'm ready for my day before this guy leaves me <laughs> One thirty-four, and Mason just woke up and I just finished lunch and we are having mac and cheese and buffalo chickpeas so it's just like some vegan mac and cheese and then some buffalo chickpeas with a little bit of ranch on top um, I normally try to make really easy lunches before Keith goes to work so I am going to eat and feed my baby and then we're gonna go on a walk it is 3.22 and we are just now leaving the house to go for a walk. We are like an hour behind uh, the way we normally do things. She just had the most random meltdown I could have ever um, imagined. It was so random. She was fine and like as soon as I started putting her in car seat, she started freaking out and she's not hungry and she just got a diaper change so honestly i don't really know what's wrong with her i started jiggling my keys around a little bit and she like immediately stopped but it was like 15 minutes of just like pure anger but she's she's fine now but she's whimpering so we're gonna go to the park now finally so here we are we're at the park. It is a super beautiful day outside. And I have my girl here. She is a lot more calm now. Now we're moving and moving. So I'm about to put in a podcast and kind of unplug from my baby for about 45 minutes. Awesome. Unfortunately, it sounds really bad to say it. But these walks are just like my time to kind of enjoy the outdoors and hopefully she takes a nap and like I said, the whole just be like a little break. Alright. 
Alright, it is 4.38 and this little baby is asleep. I'm going to change her diaper and then nurse her and then depending on how she's feeling afterwards, we'll do a little bit more tummy time and um, she might even honestly fall asleep after. Alright, so tummy time part two, actually part three, because we did it a little bit earlier, we just weren't on camera. Oh. Yeah? Are you ready for more fun? So one of the things that I use to keep her um, engaged during oh. tummy time <laughs> is this Lil Critter oh. Spin and Discover oh. Ferris wheel. Um, you can't really tell because it's a little bit dark in the corner that we're in right now. <laughs> yeah! Oh. So... Um, basically, it's a green frog uh, with a flower on it, a brown bear with two balloons, and a blue bird with um, three stars on it. And the sounds that it makes when you spin the wheel, see, look at her looking at it. She loves it. The lights and the noise, and then you press on. Green froggy press on the thing and it teaches them their colors and um you know like how to identify different animals so this just gives her something to look at and i'll put it right and over here the on the, the outside i was using it in the first video but i'm not really sure <laughs> if you were able to see it or not because it was kind of on the other side of the camera and i didn't really um explain what it was or what and i was the doing with to it. play with the animal are you ready for more fun? One flower. Hey. Hey. Spin the wheel to play with the animals. <laughs> Alright, it is 7.47 and I am making dinner. It's just a bean and rice quesadilla. Um, and I'm having some of this like leftover Asian salad. Um, Nathan is asleep. And for all those people who are going to yell at me and comment about the way that she's laying in her maru, I am keeping a super close eye on her dog's right there he's obsessed with her so nothing bad's gonna happen to my little cherub while she's in there um when she wakes up we will do bath time and then a final feeding and then i will read to her for a little bit and then we'll go to bed she's normally in bed between nine and ten after 10. I have the mobile turned on for my girl. Um, so she does sleep in her bassinet in our room. This is like our little changing area for the nighttime. This lamp and then just you know wipes, diapers, Tylenol, the white noise machine and some spit rags and this is a swaddle and keeps everything close together so when she wakes up in the middle of the night it's not a huge ordeal i literally am asleep 
right here. I'm sitting on my bed. And her bassinet is right there. So anyway, I'm going to leave her alone, try to get her to sleep. She loves falling asleep with the mobile music. And yeah, we'll see how this goes. <laughs> All right, it is 10.30, and at about 10.15, I went in and I checked on my babe, and she is asleep, and I guess that this concludes our vlog for the day. Um, I hope you guys learned, if you don't have kids, what a day in the life with a newborn is like, and yeah, it was definitely um an experience that I was not expecting vlogging with a newborn I thought it would be really easy but it was surprisingly trying I guess is the word that I'm looking for anyway if you like this video go ahead and give it a like a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and if you don't like the video then I'm sorry I think anyway if you guys have any questions or if there's anything that you would like to see from me any videos that you would like me to make go ahead and comment those down below i love getting suggestions from people and my friends and yeah thanks for spending the day with us guys